Jenny here again from Age UK Trafford. Another video for you today and today's video is something that we haven't done before so we've done a little bit of physical activity previously and today's video is going to be trying to help you with a little bit of mental activity so we're going to have a quiz together today. Um, there will be three different categories we've got a general knowledge category we've got uh, some questions on movies and also some questions on British sitcoms as well. So before we get started make sure you have all that you need so you will need a pen or a pencil to write with you'll need something to write on as well so if you go and get yourselves organized I have the questions in front of me um, you can pause the video whenever you wish no cheating no googling no nothing like that see if you can do it from your from your own knowledge um, we'll go through all of the questions first and then we will revisit them and I will give you the answers so good luck everybody okay everybody ready then we will begin so the first category is going to be uh, general knowledge and the first question is aerodynamics is the study of what is it a birds b air in motion c animals or d caves next question is mycology m y c o L O G Y mycology is the study of what? Is it A elections, B animals, C birds, or D fungi? Next question calcium carbonate is more commonly known as what? Is it A chalk, B baking soda, C vinegar, or D? salt next one is who wrote for whom the bell tolls was it a ernest hemingway b george eliot c henry james or d james joyce the halfpenny bridge lies in which irish city is it A, Limerick, B, Galway, C, Cork, or D, Dublin? The next question is, where are the headquarters of NATO? Are they in A, Brussels, B, Amsterdam, C, Paris, or D, Geneva? Gravelax is what type of food? Is it A. Cheese, B. Fish, C. Apple or D. Meat? Which seabird has the largest wingspan of any living bird? <clears throat> is it A. Heron, B. Albatross, C. Egret or D. Pigeon. Next question. A Bellini cocktail consists of champagne and which juice flavour? Is it A. Apple, B. Peach, C. Orange or D. Cherry? Claustrophobia is the fear of what? Is it A. Water, B. Closed spaces, C. Thunder, or D. Pain? Moussaka is traditionally a national dish of which country? Is it A. Australia, B. Mexico, C. Greece, or D. France? Magpies are part of which larger bird family? Is it A. Crow, B. Blackbird, C. Raven or D. Sparrow? And the last question in the general knowledge round is who wrote the classic work All the King's Men? Was it A. Jules Verne? B. Lou Wallace, 
C. George Orwell or D. Robert Penn Warren. Okay, so that's all your general knowledge questions. We shall move on to the next category, which is movies. <coughs> okay. <coughs> Excuse me. All right, so same number of questions again in this category. So let's switch our brains over to our movie knowledge now, and we will see how we go. So first question in this category is... Complete the title of a 1965 classic, The Ip Chris What? Is it A, document, B, file, C, tale, or D, story? Okay, next question is, which of these James Bond movies was released before the others? Was it A, From Russia With Love, B, Thunderball, C, Goldfinger, or D, Doctor No? Next question is, which Hitchcock movie came first? Was it A, The Birds, B, Vertigo, C, Family Plot, or D, North by Northwest? Okay, next question is, who plays the title character in Dr. Zhivago? Was it A, Alec Guinness, B, Sid James, C, Richard Burton, or D, Omar Sharif? And the next question is, which movie was inspired by the life of photographer David Bailey? Was it A, Performance, B, Blow Up, C, The Ip Chris File, or D, Tinker Tailor, Soldier, Spy? The next question. Food, Glorious Food is a song from which musical? Is it A, Half a Sixpence, B, Chitty Chitty Bang Bang, C, Bed Knobs and Broomsticks, or D, Oliver? Next question is who directed the 1971 version of A Clockwork Orange? Was it A, Stanley Kubrick, B, Alfred Hitchcock, C, Richard Lester, or D, David Lean. Uh, which pop star starred in the 1970 film, perform film performance? Was it A, David Bowie, B, Mick Jagger, C, John Lennon, or D, Paul McCartney? Next one is, who played the lead role in Alfie, the 1966 version? Was it A, Laurence Olivier, B, Michael Caine, C, Sid James, or D, Alec Guinness? Okay, a couple more questions to go in this category. So, which 1994 film is based on a play by Alan Bennett? Is it A, A Man for All Seasons, B, The Commitments, C, The Madness of King George, or D, Secrets and Lies? Which playwright wrote the work on which A Man for All Seasons is based? Was that A, Oscar Wilde? B. Robert Bolt, C. Alan Bennett, or D. William Shakespeare. Which Carry On movie was released before the others? Was it A. Follow That Camel, B. Doctor, C. Henry, 
or D, camping. And the last question in this category is which classic British film is based on a novel by John Brain? Is it A, Chariots of Fire, B, Room at the Top, C, Lawrence of Arabia, or D, Gandhi? Okay, you can have a breather on your movie knowledge because we are moving on to our British sitcom knowledge. So this is our last category um, and then we will go through the answers of all of the questions so far. So when you are ready, the first question in the British sitcom category is Alf Garnet was the main character in which sitcom? Is it A, Till Death Do Us Part, B, Butterflies, C, Rising Damp, or D, As Time Goes By? Next question is, in which county was the fictional village of Dibley? Is it A, Cornwall, B, Oxfordshire, C, Kent, or D, Suffolk? Next one is Baldrick is a notable character from which sitcom? Was it A, The Vicar of Dibley, B, Faulty Towers, C, Blackadder, or D, Dad's Army? And the next one we have is Molly Sugden, starred in which UK sitcom? Was it Are You Being Served, Hello Hello, C, Heidi High? Or D, Phoenix Knights. Next one is Frankie Howard, starred in which show? Was it A, Hello, Hello, B, Up Pompeii, C, Goodnight Sweetheart, or D, As Time Goes By? Next one is Hello, Hello, is set during which war? Was it A, World War I, B, the Crimean War, C, the Cold War, or D, World War II? Next one is Del Boy and Rodney are leading characters in which sitcom? Was it A, the Vicar, the Vicar of Dibley, B, Only Fools and Horses, C, Dad's Army, or D, Blackadder. Don't mention the war is a phrase associated with which series? Is it A. Father Ted? B. Only Fools and <coughs> Oh, excuse me. B. Only Fools and Horses. C. Yes Minister. Or D. Faulty Towers. <coughs> Next one is Penelope Keith, starred in which sitcom? Was it A, The Good Life, B, One Foot in the Grave, C, Open All Hours, or D, Keeping Up Appearances? Uh, next one is Victor Meldrew appeared in which UK sitcom? Was it A, Father Ted, B, One Foot in the Grave, C, keeping up appearances, or D, hello, hello. Three more to go. Next one is James Bolam plays one of the leading characters in which series? Was it A, The Likely Lads, B, Porridge, C, To the Manor Born, or D, My Family? Penultimate one. What is Arkwright's first name in Open All Hours? Is it A. Albert, B. Mike, C. Ronald, or D. Frank? And the very last one is Jim Hacker is a notable character in which TV series? Is it A. Yes Minister, B. Porridge, C, Dad's Army, or D, Open All Hours. 
So you can have a little bit of a pause, you can stop the video. Those are all the questions now. What I'm going to do is go back to where we started and give you the answers. So let's have a see. So the first round, if you remember, was general knowledge. And the first question was about aerodynamics. Now the answer is aerodynamics is a study of, it was B, air in motion. So a big tick if you got it right. You can write the answer if you didn't, okay? The second one was mycology, and it was asking whether that was a study of, or what that was a study of, and that was D, fungi. Next question was about calcium carbonate, more commonly known as, and that's A, chalk. The question now is who who wrote from whom the bell tolls? If you put A, Ernest Hemingway, you would be absolutely right. The Hapney Bridge, that lies in the Irish city of D, which was Dublin. Then we had where the headquarters of NATO are, and if you put A, Brussels, you would be right again. Gravel axe is what type of food? The answer to this one is B, fish. And the seabird with the largest wingspan is B, albatross. Abellini cocktail consists of champagne and what juice flavour? The answer is B, peach. And claustrophobia was a or is a fear of B, again, closed spaces. Moussaka is traditionally a national dish from, and it was C, Greece. Magpies are part of the larger bird family of the crow, which was answer A on that one. And the last one in this category was who wrote the classic work All the King's Men? And if you answered D, Robert Penn Warren, you would be absolutely right. So give yourself a little bit of a total. I think there's 13 questions in each of the categories. So see how many you got from those. And let's move on to the answers for the movie category. So the first question in this category was... The uh, 1965 classic was the Ipcris file. Um, the answer to that was actually in one of the questions a little bit further down as well. Um, so the next question was um, which of the James Bond movies was released before the others? And the answer was D, Doctor No. The next question was, um, which Hitchcock movie came first? That answer was B, Vertigo. And then we had, um, who played the lead character or the title character in Dr. Zhivago? And that was D, Omar Sharif. Then we had, um, which movie was inspired by the life of photographer David Bailey? And that was B, Blow Up. Then Food Glorious Food was a song from, and that was D. Oliver. We had um, who directed um, the 1971 version of A Clockwork Orange, and that was A. Stanley Kubrick. And then we had um, which pop star starred in the 1970 film Performance, and that was B. Mick Jagger. Then we had um, who played the lead role in Alfie, the 1966 version. And if you put Michael Caine, you can give yourself a tick. The 1994 film that's based on a play by Alan Bennett is C, The Madness of King George. And the playwright that wrote the work on which A Man for All Seasons is based was B. Robert Bolt. Two more to go in this category. The next one was which Carry On movie was released before the others? And that was answer B. It was Doctor, Carry On Doctor. And the last one in this category was uh, which classic British film is based on a novel by John Brain? And the answer is B, Room at the Top. 
so well done on that category and we've got one more to go so the answers for the last category for british sitcoms so first question was alf garnet was the main character in which sitcom and that was a till death do us part then we had in which county was the fictional village of dibley and that was b oxfordshire then we had Baldrick was a notable character in C, Blackadder. And Molly Sugden starred in A, Are You Being Served? Then we had Frankie Howard starred in uh, which show, which was B, Up Pompeii. And the next one was A Low, A Low was set during which war? And that was D, World War Two. We've got Del Boy and Rodney were leading characters in, <coughs> of course, Only Fools and Horses, which was B. Um, don't mention the war was a phrase associated with, which was D, Faulty Towers. So well done if you've got that one. Penelope Keith was the next one. She appeared in A, The Good Life. And Victor Meldrew was a character in which UK sitcom and that was B One Foot in the Grave. Uh, next one was uh, James Bolan. He was the leading character in A The Likely Lads. And we've got a couple more to go. Arkwright's first name in Open All Hours and that was A Albert. And the very last one for today's quiz is Jim Hacker was a notable character in A Yes Minister. So hopefully that's provided you with a little bit of um, activity to keep you going, a little bit of entertainment. Um, well done for all of the questions that you've got right. Um, we will try and do another quiz um, in another few days. We'll have a look at some different categories. Um, but I hope you enjoyed it and we shall see you all soon. Take care. Bye bye.